Hi guys, it's me again. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to make some uh, vegetables with shrimp and coconut milk. Really easy. Let's start cooking. First, I put some olive oil in a pan. You can use any kind of uh, oil. Then you're gonna put um, the garlic and the ginger. I love ginger. Especially when I'm cooking with the coconut milk. And lots of garlic. And you just saute. Maybe like a few minutes or it's up to you. I like when I smell the garlic and the ginger. Look at my dog. You see my dog's nose. He's <laughs> trying to smell the food. <laughs> so for this and then we're gonna put the onion and the chili paper. Those are spicy, by the way, the chili paper. I like spicy. Tapos. And then we're gonna add the veggies. This is like a sitao, the long beans. I finally found some long beans at the Asian store. Sometimes they didn't have it, so uh, sometimes I use the the regular beans, baggy beans. But I went this morning and I found it. And we're gonna put some salt and black pepper. I don't put a lot of salt because um, I can have salty food. So just a little bit and then if my family wants salt that they can just add when when they're eating just gonna mix it and then I'm going to add a squash calabasa that's from my garden fresh the one that I picked the day before then you just mix it and then cover up and now I'm going to add the coconut milk. I bought the coconut milk from the can. So it's a lot easier. Then we just mix it up again. I love vegetables with coconut milk. But I can eat them all the time. It's not good for me. Just cover up and then now we're gonna add the green onion. I love this green onion. That's from the store because um my green onion from the garden died. It's too hot. Now I'm gonna add the shrimp. The shrimp is already cooked. It's frozen when I bought it. I prefer the frozen one. Sometimes uh, I'm scared to buy the fresh because I don't know how long the the shrimp has been sitting there. Especially when you get it from the Asian store, it just sit there. I don't know how long has that been there, so I just buy the frozen one from Walmart. <laughs> And there it is, guys. It's almost cooked. Can't wait to eat. I hope my family likes it. They never really try with coconut milk vegetables. We'll see. And now I add some uh, salmon pieces. It's like I, uh, I had a salmon because I make salmon that day too. So I just add some pieces of salmon. And there it is. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good blessed day. Bye-bye.